Hi, uh, in this video we're going to look at creating a main menu in Delphi and moving to sub-menus from our main menu. Firstly, we're going to open Delphi. We're going to start off by creating the main menu. So we're going to click on File, New, VCL Forms Application. And the first thing I'm going to do to this form is I'm going to save it. So I'm going to click File, Save All. I have already created a folder named Project 2017. So we're going to click on that. The file name, I'm going to call it main menu underscore u for unit. Save. Then the project, I'm going to call main menu underscore p for project. And we're going to click on save. We can give the form and names and a caption so I'm gonna to go to caption first since it's visible and on caption we're gonna say main menu and if you want to give your form your main menu form a name we can go to name instead of giving it form 2 we will call it main menu Next, I'm going to drop a button, T button, and actually let's add about three buttons to this main menu. Okay, I have now three buttons, and I'm going to give them names. We're going to start with the first button and we're going to change its name to insert btn for button insert and we can change the caption as well and the caption something very simple insert Okay, the next one we can call delete. So we're going to go to name. And we're going to say btn delete. And returning to caption, we can just take out btn. And the caption of that button is delete. So we have enough to actually create a sub menu and be able to run from the main menu to the next form. The next thing I want you to do is click on File, New, and we're going to create a form. And we're going to call this form, Form Insert. So File, Save As, ensure that it's in the same folder called Project 2017. The name we're going to give it is FRM for Form Insert, underscore U for Unit save now on the form you can see the title is form one we're gonna go and give it a name so we're scrolling down to name and we're gonna call this frm form insert and the caption to suit the name we are going to give it a caption called insert okay now what we want to do is move from when we click on insert we must come to the form called insert now for us to be able to do that we know the name of this form is form insert underscore u so the first thing we're gonna do is go to our main menu let's click on code and then under, under our user section we're gonna come out and stipulate the form frm insert underscore u so that we'll be able to call for the form insert frm insert underscore u and if we run that we'll notice our main menu comes up and if we click on insert nothing happens so let's carry on if we go to the design on the main menu 
if I double click on insert I must be able to call for the form and FRM the name of the form is form insert that's the variable name that I gave it dot show modal and that will be able this this statement will call for the form insert okay we're gonna test that so if I click on run and then click on insert you'll notice that the form insert opens I have nothing on it at this stage and if I close that I return to my main menu once again click on insert you come to your form and we can close that and we return to our main menu in the same way we can create a form called delete and move to delete and return to the main menu. In the next video, we will look at how we insert into a database via code.